सॉल्व साइन टू एक्स इक्वल टू फाइव कॉस टू एक्स वेर एक्स लाइज फ्रॉम जीरो टू वन एटी डिग्री दे टोल्ड यू टू सॉल्व सो यू शुड फाइंड द वैल्यूज फॉर एक्स सैटिस्फाइंग दिस इक्वेशन एंड ऑल्सो इट शुड लाइव बिटवीन जीरो टू वन एटी डिग्री फर्स्ट द गिवन इक्वेशन इज साइन टू एक्स इक्वल टू फाइव कॉस टू एक्स इन दिस इक्वेशन देर आर टू ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रेशियोज दे आर साइन एंड कॉस बट टू सॉल्व इट देर शुड बी ओनली वन ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रेशियो एंड हाउ आई डू दैट सी we should divide by cos 2x on both sides now when we divide sin by cos is nothing but tan 2x equal to this cancel out i get 5 now to get the values for 2x here we have tan and here it is positive so now you check in what all quadrants is tan positive it is all silver t cups it's positive in the first and it's positive in the third to get an angle in the first we do directly tan inverse 5 to get an angle in the third we do 180 plus tan inverse 5 now calculate this you should get 78.7 calculate this you should get 258.7 now the question arises shall i get another more values for 2x or not how do we decide based on this one c here x lies from 0 to 180 degrees here we have 2x so to get 2x you multiply by 2 throughout so we get 0 less than or equal to 2x less than or equal to 360 now i am clear when 2x values lie in this interval 0 to 360 automatically x will lie in the interval 0 to 180 clear now you should check here whether 2x lie in the interval 0 to 360 or not here we have checked these two lie in this interval to get another value i have to add 360 to this that will not lie in this interval so i don't need to consider that clear now now to get the values for x this 2 should be removed for that you divide by 2 throughout so we get x equal to 72 78.7 by 2 will result in 39.3 258.7 divided by 2 is 129.3 this is our answer Am I clear?